We're here with American head coach Matt Corkery. Big victory for the Eagles on the road tonight at Bucknell. Coach, congratulations first and foremost. Uh, I want to talk a little bit about just the, the strategy that your team employed early on in this game. It looked like you came out with a lot of uh, intensity defensively and you really forced Bucknell into some turnovers early. We did. I thought our energy level was really good. We were locked in on some of our defensive rotations and you know we feel like a couple of the strengths of our team are uh, our depth and our athleticism, so we really want to try to capitalize on that whenever we can. Um, I thought we did a nice job early, and then Bucknell had some success, you know, attacking that pressure late, so they kind of turned the tables a little bit. It's a, a bit of a learning process for us right now because we're doing some new things with that with that defensive pressure, so we're still trying to figure it out. What were some things that Bucknell did? You, you just alluded to some of the adjustments they made. What did they specifically do that enabled them to counteract the pressure that your team was bringing? I think the first thing was get stops, you know? So we're not able to set the pressure uh, after, your, after a miss, you know, and I thought they did a really nice job of attacking and pushing out and running at us, you know, in transition. So they had us on our heels a little bit. So it began with them getting stops or our inability to score, and that relayed into some transition opportunities. Yeah. How Just how big of a victory is this coming into to a place uh, here on the road? Uh, you know, your, your team's played very well on the road this season. Just how important of a victory is this, especially considering that you had the early cushion and they came back to, to tie in the second half? Yeah, yeah. You know, I think it's, I think it's a, a good quality win. I don't think there are any big wins, you know, this early in the season. You know, it's uh, obviously Bucknell is a very good team. So for us to be able to come in here and have some success, you know, bolsters our confidence and it gives us something to, to feel good about. But our, our vision is in the future and looking ahead. And they don't give out any trophies in January. So we want to just try to keep figuring out ways to get better. I think that's what everybody's doing right now. Uh, but definitely proud of the effort and proud of the execution and the plays that we made to win the game. And real quick, you talked about the future. Coming up on Saturday, you've got a game against Lafayette, a team that played you tough in the last two times that right. the two teams faced each other at the end of last season. Um, and you have them coming up on Saturday. They just got a, a second league victory tonight at Colgate, so that's a Lafayette okay. team playing with a lot of confidence right now. Just your thoughts on that game. Yeah, very talented team, you know, and they offer uh, a lot of uh, mismatch opportunities, you know, in that they have a lot of size, you know, so... With Fiaco being a shot blocker, Holman's one of the best post players in the league. Their point guard's playing excellent. You know, so Diane has that team, you know, playing well. And anytime we go all back on the road, you know, to play or even at home, it's going to be tough. So we're going to uh, start focusing on those guys uh, when we get on the bus, on the bus ride home, and, uh, and go from there. But we know we'll have to play really well to have a chance to win. Coach, congratulations. Thank you very much. Appreciate it.